guys, it's Alicia and welcome back to my channel. You guys saw me do five of my favorite male characters from the mystery and suspense subgenre. Well, today I'm talking about the guys again, but this time I'm talking about the Christian romance section. So I went through my collection, but I'm just picking out the names that really pop out to me or names that I've always loved. I have not read some of these books, probably most of them I still have not read because I have a buying problem and I can't quite read as fast as I buy. <laughs> but I thought that I'd still show the books because names are huge things to me. I love when I love the names. Somehow, kind of love the character just a little bit more when I love their name. Is that weird? I don't know. I don't know. Well, anyways, today we're going to be talking about the romance section and the males in the romance section. The males with the nice names in the romance section. <laughs> so here we go. Five of my favorite male character names from the romance books. The first name that I'm going to talk about is actually from a love inspired book, which I wasn't going to add into this. One, I was going to do, like, its own little thing. I really like this guy's name, so I'm going to add him into this subgenre. But that is Hunter from Her Texas Cowboy by Jill Lynn. I looked at the back, and I was like, his name is Hunter. Such a cute name. I love it. The cover is gorgeous, and Hunter's a cowboy. So that makes him. The next one is Colin from The Sweet Smell of Magnolias and Memories, and this is by Celeste Fletcher McHale, and I've always loved the name Colin. I had a friend in elementary school, can't remember what grade, his name was Colin, and we were best friends. I've always loved the name, and so I was kind of excited to read the back of this and figure out the guy's name is Colin, and then to read the back of this and figure out, like, find out what it was about was kind of cool. So I'm excited to read this book and read more about our Colin. <laughs> the next is technically two books, so I guess I could have broken it up, but it's in one paperback. And it is the Spring Brides Collection, and there are two names that I absolutely love. So the first one is Marshall from The April Bride by Lenora Worth. And Marshall, I love when they have that last name. But when it's a first name, again, something about the unique names. I love it. The next one is Grey from A May Bride by Meg Mosley. And I love the name Grey. I don't know. Like Grayson. Love. Love the name Grayson. So Grey is really pretty too. It's really handsome, I guess, is the correct terminology for that. But love both of these names. And I also can't wait to read this. Again, have a buying problem. The next one I'm going to talk about is Jackson Drake from Always the Baker, Never the Bride by Sandra D. Bricker. And again, Jackson is such a cute name. Um, I love it. I just, you know, not many more adjectives I can use to describe the reasons why I enjoy these names. I just think they're cool. I think they're unique and I like them. And Jackson is another one. And the last name that I'm going to talk about is Ty Porter from Meant to Be Mine by Becky Wade. And love the name Ty. Any Heartland peeps out there? Yes. I've always loved the name Ty. Um, a little more than Tyler, but I just, I've liked the name. Ty's really cool. I read the back. Figured out what it was about. Kind of freaked. About horses, it's about rodeo things, and it's great. So I'm very excited to start the Porter Family series because it's like a whole thing, and I need to get to more of the books. But that's beside the point. I just really like the name, and yeah, he's also a cowboy. What more could you want? Really, what more could you want? And just like last week, I'm gonna pick another biblical name that I've always loved, and that is Micah. The, it just kind of rolls off the tongue, Micah. And it's just, I don't know, kind of musical. It's just very pretty. I've always loved the name, and yeah, that, 
ton of my favorite biblical names. I have quite a few, so I could probably go on longer about my favorite biblical names since there are so many and I don't know. I hope you guys enjoyed week two of this fun new thing that I'm doing because I like it. <laughs> if you guys like it, please let me know if it's not something that you enjoy. I don't know. I would love I would love to hear you guys' input. I'm really enjoying it, so I hope you guys enjoy it. You can follow my blog for the love of Christian Fiction .com, where I post every Friday. And you can follow my Instagram for the love of Christian Fiction, where I'm pretty active on there too. All my other links are in the description box below and I think that's it. I'll see you guys next week. Bye!